hello everyone it's me asmr welcoming you to my new photoshop tutorials and today i'll show you this type of urban vibes preset for you guys and let's start the tutorial if you're new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications i used here the photo from prepeak for the stock image and i'll provide you the download link in my video description so at first i'm selecting this photo press ctrl or command j and then i'm using uh, here photoshop 2021 please do update your version according to me and please just the camera filter uh, just look at the window which key i just pressed that is the controller command shift and a that is the uh, camera filter i'm using the camera filter 13.0.2 and i'll provide the update link in my video description please do update for that so i made lots of preset in this time uh, so here are lots of preset actually from that preset collection i'll modify uh, one of them so this one is 19 asm uh, 19 preset and from the basic panel i'll do the uh, correction of this preset so in this preset i'll decrease the exposure contrast making it up dehaze making it like this so after that uh, warm is good and from here detail uh, i'll reduce the noise a little bit and sharpening like this and the color mixture i'll uh, decrease or increase the aqua color and blue color actually and at first i'll um, uh, changing all the stuffs and i'll um, uh, just discuss about you, you know, why uh, or how the color will appearing the calibration i'll make the calibration a little bit like uh, mm, uh, like 17 blue primary and green uh, that is plus 7 and red primary that's good yeah that's fine so let's discuss about what i used over here in the basic panel uh, plus 3 for the warm tone here you are looking a little bit warm like that and tin minus 12 uh, like um, the aqua um, feel and which is related with the uh, green actually that's why minus 12 a little bit like a uh, greenish type exposure minus 0.55 and contrast i make it 43 and highlight plus 17 and shadow plus 100 and the egg blacks that is minus 13 if you need you can make it like that so this one is not the constant or you know, like uh, fixed just because of when you are using this preset in your photoshop or in your photographs uh, it could be changed up according to your lights actually this is the technique to use the uh, xmp file in uh, photoshop or lightroom and you know that xmp is uh, supporting file in a uh, photoshop and lightroom as well so here the vibrance that is 5 is good for me and the saturation that is 5 that's good and the texture that is 0 clarity 0 and dehaze what's the dehaze dehaze is that the uh, photo will be more clearer that means if, you know, foggy and clear this one is the two things if you make it hazy it will be foggy and if you make it the dehaze that means the plus value of the dehaze it will be clear now curves i make the curves like that i made uh, for you guys the curves talking itself that means the upper side is a white color that means you will take the uh, if you take this one in upper side it will be more lighter if you take this in the downside it will be more darker so it's talking itself okay the detailing options the sharpening amount that is 30 noise reduction that is 27 all the things that uh, by default here is small a triangle which will help you to out uh, like uh, according to setup and here the color noise you know two types of noise over there in a photo uh, one is the normal noise that means the black and white noise and the color noise i made the color noise 25 for uh, the safest uh, options if you don't need these type options please don't use that this one is the assumption to use for you guys uh, just because of uh, uh, this example photo and your exam your photo is not accordingly that's why you will adjust your white balances your colors all the stuff like that here the color mixture hue saturation luminance hue all the colors over there the reds orange yellow green and uh, all the stuffs so reds start from the pink and uh, ends in a yellow uh, actually orange so in the middle of the color which color you'll pick up this one is a value that means 53 this value is a little bit orange type and if i make it this one it will be pink type so this one is the color which color will be it defines with the hue that means uh, the value will define the color which color 
and the orange minus 21 and the yellow minus 33 green minus 100 and aqua 0 blue minus 46 that's why you are getting the uh, blue things into aqua if i make it like that you will get the blue options over here but i'll made it like aqua like this the hue the purples that is zero and the magenta zero saturation percentage of the color how many color or uh, what is the value of the color how deep will be the color this one defines with the saturation that is minus 19 for the orange minus 90 no, 39 for the green and the aqua minus 42 and blue plus 25 the majority of the blue and orange i want to make this one uh, that's why i make the blue uh, like 25 and the orange if you need you can increase but if you increase that too much uh, it will affect on the photo or like face uh, that's why i didn't use that and the luminance this one is the intensity of the color the red intensity that is 54 and orange plus 18 and green plus 66 aqua plus 97 and the blue that is 85 that's good going to the color grading here i use the shadow color uh, here again you are getting the hue and saturation which color be will be in the shadow it defines with the hue and the saturation percentage of the color here the mid-tone if you increase the mid-tone into bluish or like orange type it will be like that the value will be 51 and the saturation that is value the 7 and the highlights in the highlight portion you are getting the color that is like this and if you make it the aqua that's fine so you can define the three things by the three colors that means the highlight you can define with the highlight color you can uh, give the color in a shadow and the mid tone as well so these three things accordingly the mix up of the uh, color grading that's fine optics didn't use that geometry no need effects if you need you can use some vignetting proscop vignetting which is really a little bit darker in uh, like uh, all the sides this one is the vignette um, options and the calibration three primary colors red green and blue and here red primary plus one and the green primary hue that is plus seven and blue primary and green primary plus seven and blue primary minus 17 so where you are going to talk about the color you are getting two things the hue and saturation hue which color will be and the saturation the percentage of the color and here i'll save this preset for you guys and i'll provide you that preset download link in my video description so saving these settings and giving the name the r1 vibes already saved this one again i'm r1 vibes asm okay and hit the okay button after uh, adding the preset i do like to use the another uh, filters which is from the nick collection going to the filter again and going to the nick collection color effects pro 4 so this one is another plugins to help you out to make the filters in your photographs from here i'm using the cross processing and lots of method over here and from here g05 i'll use that that is uh, like different type you know, like uh, aqua and urban type fills which is really good and uh, another stops or another filters you can use for your uh, convenience and uh, this one is totally for the experimental things so i'm using the z05 and the strength of the uh, that is the filter that is 33 and hit the okay it will take time to uh, apply the effects in this photo and provide you the final output in this portion so before and after or let's try this preset to another photo so already i use that and uh, this type of photo suppose this photo press ctrl or command j and after that i'm going to the camera filter and loading up the preset which is this urban vibes asm so in this case I need to change the highlight or exposure a little bit down and then hit the OK button. That's fine. So after that, going to the filter, Nick Collection, Color Effects Pro 4. From here, I'll apply that preset or that uh, filter so which I used earlier and hit OK. After that, I'm going to the uh, like levels. I want to change the uh, color things. OK, that's fine. So I think this one is creative and uh, really creative things for you guys. If you want to use this preset, please do 
uh, like subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon and check out my video description don't forget to leave a comment in my video comment section until the next video i mean seven signing today stay safe stay at home keep me in your prayers as well bye bye